Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to Pro Tools Help. In today's uh, tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to solo a vocal or track inside of a Pro Tools session. Again, this is for a beginner or someone who's new to the Pro Tools software. I just want to get you guys a little bit more familiar with it. You'll use this a lot when you're mixing and uh, when you're trying to edit vocals. <clears throat> so I'm going to go into my uh, Pro Tools track or session. Uh, let's go to the harp. I'm always referring to the harp. <laughs> Uh, I just really want to get you guys straight to the point. I don't really want to sit here and talk for hours. Um, all I'm going to do is go over here right next to the mute button. I'm going to click the S. And what this means is that the I'm only going to hear the breathless harp. This means it's soloed. So as every time you see the S um, highlighted, that means you're only going to hear the track that's highlighted. So we can play. You're not going to hear the piano, you're not going to hear the drum kicks, nothing like that. If I unsolo it, you're going to hear everything. But as soon as I solo it, you're, going to, you're only going to hear the harp. So, you'll use this a lot when you're mixing or editing vocals. It just gives you uh, the option to only listen to whatever vocal it is that you want to hear at the time by itself. Without the beat or without any other vocals behind it. It's uh, it's really cool, actually. Uh, I hope you guys learned something new. If you guys have any questions, please email me. I'd love to get back to you guys and help you. Please subscribe and enjoy, guys.